I love kitties. Uh, this kitty, what's this kitty's name? Speckles. Speckles is in heat and hid behind that door all night long and screamed. All night. All night long. It's time for breakfast. Your Doablo nut. Do Diablo nut. Doablo nut. Doablo nut. Explain what is a Diablo nut. No. How'd you sleep, bud? Not well. Oh no. Well, thanks for letting us stay at your house. Oh, you're welcome. We appreciate it. Yeah, we really do. We don't like sleeping in the van. You rub your urethra with hot sauce in the next Please don't do that. Oh, God. We're gonna play a quick game of hot sauce, people. For a fiery explosion. <laughs> Somebody's gonna grab the Q-tip first. So one whole Diablo packet on the donut. Two. I don't know. I think you should just cover the thing like it's glazed. Do a little design. Uh-huh. Taco Bell is this for this one. Feed the beat. Yes. Look at that glaze. Cool. Oh, the smell. <laughs> oh, the smell. <laughs> oh, gotta get the drip shot. Oh. Bottoms up. It was just like a spicy donut. Never waffle over breakfast decisions again. Oh, a waffle, that's interesting. <clears throat> oh, hell yeah, brother. Huh. You see what I mean? It tastes just kind of just lays on it. It's not really... No, it's disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to find things to... You guys want to go to the Soldiers and Sailors Monument? I've, I've never been there. Yes. You need one of those ride symbol bead strings. Becoming a communist. In six easy steps. <clears throat> Number one. Uh, the internet. Research everything. Use Google to your advantage. Or Bing, if that's your thing. Number two. Seize the means. <laughs> number number two, <laughs> question mark. Number three, question mark. All right, so we're heading to Indianapolis to go see a uh, memorial of some sort. I don't really remember what it is. But, uh, <laughs> man, um, I, I still don't even really know where we're going on this tour. All right, well, we can run whatever we, we're calling this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, we're going to Indianapolis today. Um, we're going to go see, I don't know the name of the monument, but we're going to go do some sightseeing before the show. It's gonna be a good time. I think it's like two hours away, so it's a nice, peaceful drive. Everyone get everything they need from the bathroom. What's up? We're such nice people. They let us stay on their floor. And thank now you. it's uh, under their desk. Thank you, Jason's parents and Jason. It's time to go to Indianapolis. Let's take the pack up. <laughs> We're hanging out. Um, I'm gonna pay for parking real quick. Okay. But we're gonna go see. Uh, that. Man, that thing's big. In memoriam of Union soldiers. Well, so hey, you to that where I'm from. <laughs> oh, wow. What is it called? It's like wax seal. And then I got this, which is apparently ass, but I want to try it. It's Moxie. Moxie, baby. I'm rich on the next set. Yeah, so we're all going to drink Moxie. this tomorrow with some good ass pizza. Um, yeah, because it just looks like Moxie, 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 Moxie. Well, no, well, I'm pretty sure, and I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure this was from the like the Indiana Civil War, and it, a lot of people don't know, but back in the late 1800s, there were aliens actually living in Indiana, because it's kind of like, it's just a state you wouldn't expect. You can kind of see, by the way, the dude's peeking around the corner, it kind of hints at the fact that there's, you know, something a little strange. He's looking at that man with the rifle like, I don't know if I trust these humans, you know? And it just started a really big event. And uh, obviously, look at us now, humans came out on top, so. Here we are. 
fuck you, Alien. It says pull. It says pull. <laughs> <laughs> you think you're up for this? Keep going. She said Seriously? once it gets warmer, then you guys feel like you're at the top, but you are at <laughs> Hey, hey boys. <laughs> What's going on? We're, well, walk, we're, we're walking, walking to, Wait, what? You go. <laughs> we're walking to the top of this monument in the uh, middle of downtown. Indianapolis, what's this thing called? Indianapolis! Minneapolis, Minnesota. Minnesota? It's 330 okay. steps. It sucks. And we're a little over halfway there. <laughs> Let's look <laughs> up. Oh no. Oh god. We're so far. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> <laughs> Stay in position. <laughs> Take the right, you need it. There's <laughs> too many stairs. That was fun. It's uh, it's not about the destination, it's about the journey. <laughs> and the journey was <laughs> awful. <laughs> I think that's Mike Pence's house out there. Yeah. I can't even jump off this thing, I don't know why we came up here. Oh, yeah. I think it's time to go. Yeah. Yep. Right now. That's a thing. This is probably the easier part, right? Oh, yeah. Wait, we see the van from here? Where? Yeah. We see it on there? On the other side of the Pennsylvania Street. Yeah, there it is. Start going right there? Right there. Yeah. Well, my knees are weak. I think my arms are spaghetti. Oh. So, oh, I had a good time. Yeah. It's pretty good. Who's your dome? But it's, it's fun. It's got beer and stuff. How are you? Good, how are you? Good. You guys so are glad to yeah. see you. Hey, what's up? Divine Martyr. I'm Woody. Nice to meet you. Pleasure to meet you too. Luke. Hello. Nice I'm Andrew. Nice to meet you, buddy. Um, but listen to some of your stuff, man. You gotta get stuff. Hey, thank you. Yeah. I appreciate that. I like your Batman shirt. It tells me <laughs> Unfortunately, that I don't look like Batman. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not adequate either. The first show, second show we played with uh, a band called O Kingdom on our first little, you know, touring run. And uh, we were playing in North Carolina, I believe, out in this this house, way in the middle of nowhere. And uh, it was a whole bunch of hardcore kids. And we we're not a hardcore band, so we thought they wouldn't like us, but you know, they went just as hard during it. And I remember looking up at a certain point during the show, uh, and I had my eyes closed, and then I open them, and I see this trash can flying through the air, and it kind of spins in slow motion as I'm watching it and somebody has spray painted kill on the side of it and it comes down and some guy runs from the other direction and he hits it, puts it on his head, starts running around and everybody and everybody beat the shit out of that guy. <laughs> that was pretty funny. <laughs> I, uh, can I just say Muncie? <laughs> oh, dude. <laughs> no, you're allowed to say, you're allowed to say. Uh, I don't what know. Happened to Muncie, that, brother? But it's not my, it's my favorite because I feel like you guys like, I mean, I get a lot of crap for it. Um, so Muncie was the last date of the first run that I ever did with Artica. It was back last fall. Um, and uh, it was at this like, it, it was some kind of reggae bar type deal. I don't know, it was cool. I had cheap beer. So I was all about it, but I found out there was a minimum to use your card, so that forced me to buy four beers, <laughs> which isn't a lot, but for someone that doesn't drink a whole lot, it was it was a lot, and I think someone gave me a drink or two. And you weren't eating that much? Yeah, kinda, yeah. And uh, I was supposed to be part of that uh, that Hot Ones kind of deal that we did, you know? The, yeah, what I was, I was I, I, Dude, I was in the van, having a hard time, rough time. I was trying to sleep, <laughs> puking. I remember driving home. Uh, I remember the ride home, we stopped at that gas station, um, puked all over, thought I was in the trash can, and, I mean, on the trash can, around the trash can. But do y'all remember like what we saw in the alleyway after that? Oh yeah, there was that couple oh. banging. Yeah, dude. <laughs> oh man, that was awful. They got that mad applause when they finished. <laughs> so as you can see, we made it to the Hoosier Dome, and we're all set up, just kind of loading in, getting ready to play, and it's kind of tradition around here, you can kind of see there's... So I'm going to go ahead and put a sticker over here. So tell us about this little habit you have of doing when you play shows. I've got a real bad habit of uh, cutting my finger open. That guy right there. And uh, Oh, you going to see it? And um, when I cut it open, you know, I'll hit it a few times on the strings. 
Hell yeah, yeah. brother. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'll, I'll, you know, I'll keep hitting it on the strings and I'll keep bleeding and I'll get blood all over my strings and it makes them sound real bad. So uh, I have to change my strings about once every two shows. What's up? We are about to go on stage in a few minutes at the Hoosier Dome. Dome is home. And I'm excited. And stretching. Because I don't do that enough before we play. Let me see your knuckles. Fuck my neck out. Crab core. If I've got a shower available. Was that a head? What was that? Huh? Did you see your head? No, that was Did you just try to shut your head on my butt? Did you just see what I did to Andrew yesterday when I did that to him? Yeah, I saw that in the vlog. But like you also completely missed my butthole. So oh, that's okay. let's kick some ass, motherfuckers. Dude, how was that set? I had a lot of fun. Um, There's a lot of energy, obviously, as you can tell from my, my new dude. Um, no, I felt really good about it. I was kind of nervous going in. I felt like, for some reason, after the show last night, my voice was like getting kind of hoarse, which never happens. Um, but miraculously, here we are. The show's done, and we fucking killed it. Oh, my house. So we just played a show at the Hoosier Dome, and it was pretty tight. We had a lot of fun. A lot of people showed up. There's a lot of cool bands playing. We're now loading out, getting everything ready to kind of head out and this lovely lady's letting us stay at her house. What's your name? Jalen. Jalen? <laughs> yes. <laughs> All thanks to Brad. <laughs> Internet friends are cool. <laughs> this is my friend Scott. He's much taller than me, but he's I, a great I, friend. I got a brick. <laughs> <laughs> what are you saying? Oh yeah, that cat is a sweetheart. <laughs> As I mentioned today, we got so... Is this theory of a dead man? Yeah, it's on my right <laughs> So They're just called theory now. <laughs> theory. So we got sodas, what? I got sodas in Indianapolis on the square. Um, and this is one that was on Hot Ones that Billie Eilish had tasted and she said it tasted like literally anus. Literal anus. So anus. we're gonna try it now and see. What do we refer to her as? William Eyelash. <laughs> William Eyelash said it tasted like literal anus. So we're gonna try it and see. It's Moxie, the original elixir, distinctively different. So <laughs> like anus. <laughs> like anus. your nope. First smell it. It kinda smells like spearmint. Okay, you I was gonna try it. Interesting. Okay. What does it taste like though? Not anus. Resident expert, come Resident expert? <laughs> if he's gonna break it down, he's gonna tell us all the ingredients. Tastes like an expired. No, spirit. if you've ever had um, sarsaparilla, right? That's not good. And you've, <laughs> like, not good. If you've ever had it, sarsaparilla and bit the root, that's what it tastes like. It's real earthy. That's fine. Yeah. Andrew's being a native Nancy. It's not good. I wouldn't drink Yeah, I mean, that's fine. Yeah. Tastes like shitty root beer. Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> so here's what happens. <laughs> 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 I went there and I was like, okay, it's, it's rude to take, like, like to take a dump at someone's house. So I was like, I'm just going to do it and I'm going to flush it real quick so it doesn't smell really bad. Well, I did it and then I flushed it, but then the water started rising and I was like, ugh. <laughs> And now you don't know how to fix it. Well, I've been plunging it for like 10 minutes now. It's not, it's, it's not like overflowing, is it? No, no it got really close and I was like... <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Dude, you should show the group chat messages we got from you. <laughs> so here's, here's what he sent. Hold on. That's funny as shit. Dude, you just cried out for help. Oh, uh, guys, I need help. The poo had even gone down the thing. The water started rising. As soon as I flushed it, the water started rising. I was. Did you all fix it? <laughs> I probably do, yeah. He said, Thank you, ma'am. We're professionals. We can take it from here. Snapped a metal coating. <laughs> <laughs> 
we're going to fix the toilet. Andrew and I are, but mostly Andrew. Um, we'll let you know how it goes in the morning. Thanks.